All right. Is this thing on? I think we're good to go. Hey, guys. Stan here. I just wanted to make a very highly unedited video talking to you guys, just me to you, with a big thanks for 400,000 subscribers. It was about a little over five months ago I was celebrating hitting 10,000 subscribers, and since then, we blew up from 10,000 to 400,000 in like such a short amount of time. I don't think I'm like one of the fastest growing YouTube channels out there, but I'm definitely like in some sort of ball game, you know, top 100,000, I don't really know. I mean, YouTube's so big, but we grew so fast, and I just wanted to say thank you for that first and foremost. I did want to talk about like, what's next? What are we doing next? And the real answer is, I don't know. I don't know what's next. I just know to continue making what I know you guys like, which I'll continue to do that. You guys love my shorts. I'm gonna keep doing shorts. I'm trying to find my foothold in long form. Like, if you look at my channel, you notice I get a ton of views on shorts, but my long form videos don't get that many views. And to explain why that is, based off of what I think, I think it's because there, YouTube is like two different platforms now. There's the shorts platform and then the long form platform. They're almost like two different things. And if you build up an audience on shorts, it doesn't necessarily 100% translate over to long forms, even if the content is similar. I've been doing a lot of experimenting trying to figure this out. So I've come to the conclusion that the shorts can give my long forms a little bit of a boost but what I got to do is step up my game making that long form content, those longer videos. And that's my mission this year is to get really good at making long form videos while still making all the short forms you guys absolutely love. And I'm just going to be trying a lot of different things. I will say that I have a second channel I'm working on that's for gaming stuff and nerdy type stuff that I'm covering. I, I figured to keep the gaming and nerdy stuff separate from this main channel. Because the moment I stopped trying to do a million things, like I was doing news videos, I was doing reaction videos, I was doing gaming videos, tutorial videos, Twitch like lecture videos. I, it was so many different things. I wasn't narrowing it down to one where like the YouTube didn't know who to show my videos to. So I, my channel just couldn't really take off. It's when I focused on short reaction videos. People like those. And I started to get kind of good at them. I'm not like, I'm, you know, the top of the line or nothing, but, you know, I feel pretty confident that I can make those and then make you guys happy. So I'm just going to keep doing that and pushing myself there. But again, what I'm really trying to do, like if with the future of this channel, I guess, would be get really good at making long forms, finding interesting stuff that you guys want to see me react to or talk about. And yeah, it's just going to take a little bit of experimenting here and there. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's pretty much... Really it. I just wanted to make a video that had no editing and just talk to you guys, say what's on my mind, be real, you know? Um, you know, another thing that I'm thinking of now that I wanted to say is uh, that I'm going to try this year is doing some live streaming. I stopped streaming on Twitch and I was doing really well over there. I was making, you know, several thousand dollars a month just by being live, playing games and stuff. It was pretty legit. You know, it was a lot of hard work. I know I, was, I can't just say all I did was play video games. Like, I had to put a lot of thought into why people wanted to be there that day. There was a lot of prep for that content, and I put a lot of energy while I was live. I want to get back into that and somehow tie making my videos for this channel into, like, doing things live. Like you guys give me stuff and I'll react to it live. And then we can turn those into the videos. So I could basically shoot my videos live in front of you guys. Kind of, you know, like this is a one-off experience. I think that I've got a lot of EXP in the live streaming department and I think it's something fun to try. So I'm going to try and get some, enough bravery and figure out a plan to be able to try pulling that off here soon. I'm thinking maybe just streaming that stuff over on Twitch and then taking the videos, put them on YouTube. But I know if I streamed on YouTube, I'd get way more viewers because Twitch, I have 20K followers. YouTube, I have 400,000 subscribers. So, I mean, it, I have a lot of unknowns. You know, I don't know what the future is exactly. It's just me continuing to try stuff to see if I can make things that you guys like. That's, that's the journey. What can I make that you guys like? And uh, it's 
it's such a, a wild ride trying to figure that out. Like I actually have such a passion for, it. I love trying to figure out what you guys want to watch and, uh, and stuff that I want to do, you know, like I, I don't want to do things that I don't, I don't enjoy doing necessarily. Uh, I got to have some sort of enjoyment out of it, but yeah, that's the, that's the mission and we'll see where we go. Thanks for watching this far guys. Appreciate it. That's the update on the channel and I'll see you in the next video. See ya.